In the quiet moments between chemotherapy sessions, Princess Catherine, beloved by her nation and cherished by her family, pens a heartfelt message to her devoted fans and supporters. As she grapples with the physical and emotional toll of her cancer diagnosis, she finds solace in the outpouring of love and encouragement that surrounds her. The journey began with a devastating blow, the diagnosis of cancer, a formidable adversary that threatened to upend her life. Yet, with the unwavering support of her husband and the resolve to face this challenge head-on, Catherine embarked on a path marked by uncertainty and courage. The chemotherapy treatments, while essential in her fight against the disease, have taken their toll, both physically and emotionally. The once familiar contours of her body have been altered, and the loss of her hair, a cherished symbol of her femininity, serves as a poignant reminder of the battles she faces each day. But amidst the pain and discomfort, Catherine finds strength in the love and support of her family, friends, and the countless well-wishers who have reached out to her in her time of need. Their prayers, messages of encouragement, and acts of kindness serve as a beacon of light in the darkness, reminding her that she is not alone in this battle. As she navigates the arduous road of chemotherapy, Catherine is filled with a sense of determination and resilience. She refuses to surrender to the grip of cancer, choosing instead to fight with every ounce of strength she possesses. For she knows that she is more than just a victim of the disease. She is a fighter, a survivor, and she is not afraid to confront the challenges that lie ahead. With each passing day, Catherine draws strength from the love of her family, the support of her fans, and the unwavering faith that guides her. She is confident in her ability to overcome this obstacle, to emerge from this experience stronger and more resilient than ever before. Yet, she is also mindful of the long and arduous road that lies ahead. The journey through chemotherapy is fraught with uncertainty, and there are bound to be moments of doubt and despair. But Catherine remains steadfast in her belief that with the love and support of those around her, she will prevail. As she continues her treatment, Catherine asks for the continued prayers and well-wishes of her supporters. Their love and encouragement are her constant companions, giving her the strength to face each day with courage and determination. Though she may not be able to respond to each message individually, Catherine wants to express her heartfelt gratitude to every single one of her admirers. Together, she believes, they will conquer this challenge, emerging victorious in the end. Her Royal Highness Princess Catherine's journey through chemotherapy is not just a battle against cancer, it is a testament to the power of love, resilience, and the unwavering human spirit. And as she faces each new day with courage and grace, she serves as an inspiration to us all. As Princess Catherine's journey through chemotherapy continues, she finds herself navigating a landscape marked by both physical and emotional challenges. The treatments, while vital in her fight against cancer, take a toll on her body, leaving her fatigued and drained. Yet, amidst the exhaustion and discomfort, she draws strength from the unwavering support of her loved ones and the countless well-wishers who stand by her side. In the quiet moments between treatments, Catherine reflects on the journey that lies ahead. She knows that the road to recovery will be long and arduous, filled with ups and downs, triumphs and setbacks. But she is determined to face each obstacle with courage and resilience, refusing to let cancer define her. One of the greatest challenges Catherine faces is the loss of her hair, a tangible reminder of the disease that threatens to consume her. Yet, 
Instead of hiding behind wigs or scarves, she chooses to embrace her baldness as a symbol of her strength and defiance. In doing so, she sends a powerful message to others battling cancer, showing them that beauty lies not in outward appearances, but in the courage to face adversity head-on. As the weeks pass and the treatments take their toll, Catherine finds herself grappling with a range of emotions, fear, uncertainty, sadness. Yet, amidst the darkness, there are moments of light, moments of joy and laughter shared with her family, moments of hope and inspiration found in the words of encouragement from her supporters. Throughout it all, Catherine remains grateful for the love and support that surrounds her. From the daily visits and phone calls from her husband and children to the messages of encouragement and acts of kindness from strangers, she is reminded time and again of the strength of the human spirit. As she continues her journey through chemotherapy, Catherine is filled with a renewed sense of purpose. She knows that her battle is not just her own. It is a battle fought by countless others who have faced cancer and emerged victorious. And she is determined to be a beacon of hope for them, showing them that with courage, determination, and the support of loved ones, anything is possible. As her treatment progresses, Catherine begins to see signs of progress, small victories that serve as reminders of the resilience of the human body and the power of hope. And with each passing day, she grows stronger, more determined than ever to overcome the obstacles that lie in her path. Though the road ahead is still long and uncertain, Catherine faces it with a newfound sense of optimism and determination. She knows that the journey will be difficult, but she also knows that she is not alone. She has her family, her friends, and her supporters standing by her side every step of the way. And as she continues her fight against cancer, Catherine remains grateful for the outpouring of love and support that sustains her. For in the darkest of times, it is the kindness and compassion of others that light the way, guiding her through the storm and towards brighter days ahead.